it's just going in the car. I am 90% positive. It is a real high probability, you guys. Hi, hi, friends. I'm at the Goodwill by my house. I just did a full day's work at home. I'm pretty proud, feeling accomplished. <laughs> and it's about eight o'clock, but they're open till nine. I thought maybe they weren't open because literally, sorry, literally five cars in the parking lot. $5.99, heck yeah. Um, but they're still open, I got an hour. There's like more employees than there are shoppers in here. That's cute, isn't it? Someone put a little decal on it, but that's cute for the cat sale. It's only $5.99. So if I go a little quick, forgive me in advance, I got an hour. <laughs> that's pretty with the transfers too. Let me see what's on sale. Purple is 50 and yellow is 30. Not that I love, you know, having to deal with a bunch of under $10 items, but when it comes to the booth, well, and to my sales, I like to, you know, have some affordable things for you guys. And then at my booth, I've said this a million times, I feel like it's really important. Oh my gosh, that's plastic. I feel like it's really important to have some affordable items too for all people that are just out trying to have fun. Maybe they're bringing their friends. You know, they really don't have a lot to spend. $1.79, that's so cute. It's just plastic. It totally looks like um, cut glass, like brilliant, doesn't it? <laughs> Sorry, someone made a comment that really, you guys have been trying to tell me back up just a little bit sometimes, and someone made a comment. <laughs> I mean, okay, I'm gonna, it might sound snarky, but really she didn't mean it that way, and she worded it kind of in a cute way. But in essence, I think that's for um, incense and stuff, Egyptian eye raw or something. But she said, you know, she likes my videos, but sometimes, you know, it's like, well, we have to wait till Yvonne backs up so we can see what she's holding. <laughs> it was something like that. And I was like, ouch, okay. I have to try to remember. Oh, look, someone upcycled that. One of those little votives. I think it's an upcycled job. I could be wrong. Cute though. I have no idea what's going on with this project. Okay, I'm just showing you guys the funny stuff that I ain't gonna buy. <laughs> That's a cute little Buddha cat. That looks like a, is that a Target or something? It's missing the strap. Okay, you guys are funny, these little bookends. Probably from Ross. They don't look old, but oh my gosh, those are so cute. Look at that. Something like that I would probably put on eBay being resin you're not going to get a whole lot for them but it's they're kind of sweet looking <laughs> i don't know why i love those little things i've got a couple of deer just for myself you know they're not worth much i think they come from big lots or something oops sorry hmm. well i think i see some rubens down there i think that's rubens right I'll get it in just a second. Let's see what this is. The Shoe Diva. $2.99. There's probably a few bucks left on that. that. Looks like a Fitz and Floyd. Pretty damaged. That is artisan pottery. German or something or Scandinavian. Hand or, doesn't that mean handmade? $3.99. Okay, we're coming up on that little Rubens piece. I'm careful on this. Oh, I was just going to say before I even turned it over, I'm careful on these because they are showing up at Marshalls, Ross, TJ Maxx, etc. $3.99. Hmm. See, at the booth, I would probably just put that for like $15. 
for someone who kind of wanted one, doesn't shop at these discount department stores, or missed the few that they got in. I'll get it for $3.99. But you guys, don't get overly excited about these when you see them. Seriously. Uh-oh. I'm going to have to get this for mom. $4.99. I don't care. I got to get it for my mom. I got to pay five bucks for that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm uncomfortable at that price, but that's for my mom. Artists and pottery again. Mm, not quite, you guys. Not quite. But that. That reminds me of that. Is it Bennett Bean or something? I learned that from Jocelyn. She showed us something. Kind of looks like that, but it doesn't have the little beans on. <laughs> but I see this, and I've got some glasses that match it. $1.99. Heck yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have to stop for a moment and get this situated. There was some more of these. $7.99, yeah. That's about a 15, $16 piece right there out of the booth. But I'm not going to pay that much. No, oh, I feel a chip just as I'm picking it up. Or I felt a chip. one. I have a plastic one that I bought at the Dollar Tree a year ago when I was still taking the pops there. It's still in the backyard. Marquee. Now this is a, I learned this and you guys backed me up on it. This is a Waterford, right? Let me, I can't get it for you guys. But this is their like diffusion line, right? Cheaper. $7.99, yeah. Marquee. Marquee by Waterford. So at that price, I'm going to leave it. That's not their best quality. That's a diffusion line. Like when a designer does a, a high-end designer, so to speak, does a cheaper line, not quite as quality. Um, okay, like clothing designers do it all the time for Target. Clothing and home goods. $4.99. I wish that wasn't cracked. I'd get that. Sure would. Next section. Let me get this situated and then I'll meet you guys over there in a second. Gosh, there's an Ohio women. I'm going to Ohio. <laughs> and some of the people that I'm going to be meeting, my friends, actually live there. So it's kind of goofy because they can get probably all the Ohio souvenirs they want. But this looks vintage, doesn't it? I know Ohio very well. This is from Ross. Let's see, $4.99 now. Nope. If it was a little more unique or a little cheaper, I might do it. Okay, someone covered this in FEMA stuff and gave it a metallic gloss. The piece is missing though, so we'll have to pass. Wow, look at this mug. Okay. We're going to get that. There's a lot going on. 3D relief shells and turtles. It's got a mark on it. We'll get it. Flashed. You can see it coming off already. It almost feels like a Bakelite substance. Might look into that here in a second. It's the end of the aisle. More art pottery, $2.99. Lots of art pottery. Yes, I'm here for it. I'm here for the art pottery. Yes, I am. <laughs> $3.99. Okay. That's cool, though. That's, you know, it's crazy cool, right? 
there's a difference. Sometimes weird stuff is just, well, you know, tacky weird. And sometimes you just see a little heart and soul in it, like that. That one's not bad, it's got some issues in the bottom. Nice, another nice little art studio pottery piece. These are too. These are kind of cool, huh? How many? Four dollar ninety nine a piece. I'm trying to decide if I like that, where the bottom is just so raw. I can't decide. I only have an hour. Might make a few mistakes here since I'm like boogieing through here. Now that looks like real silver. It sure does. It smells like it too. I'm gonna set that here. That looks like it might be real silver. Drop it down. But this looks like it's gonna be commercial, but man, that's cute. Ah, it's gonna feel too new. Yes, Jeanette Adams for Sylvester. So what is that, like 80s, 90s? How much is it? Darn, they're sweet though, aren't they? Tiffany Blue. They're sweet. Okay, I'm trying to get to this penguin. <laughs> oh gosh, 10 bucks. 1991. That might be a name too. $9.99. I'll look it up because I'm going to be closing this place down and so I'll look it up. Oh, hold up. I'm getting excited, you guys. Look at this. $1.49. Shut the front door. Are you kidding me? Whew, that was fun. I would stop and like get a little bit more excited and take a moment if I had more time. Made in England. Exclusive design. Ooh, one of my friends takes, collects English teapots. Let me take a picture of that because I don't know if she's on board with the transfers. Okay, I'll send that to her. I'll send that to her tonight. And if she says, yeah, I'll pick it up in the morning. I'll be here, open, open, open. <laughs> Karen, Karen Wilder. $3.99, dang, that's a good one too. There's some pretty nice art pottery. And I am probably being too picky. Yeah, I think I will come back in the morning with a fresh attitude, not feeling like, you know, rushed. Okay, this is a little insane. I... It's just going in the car. I am 90% positive, only 90%, but that this is a more rare swirl, fire and light. It is a real high probability, you guys. It's a little smaller than I remember, but we're going to get that and take a chance. This right here is everything. And then if that is a fire and light, that even trumps this. <laughs> Crazy. I'm actually on my way to Walmart. I got to pick up a couple things. But I think I told you this one here by my house is like on the way to Walmart. So what can I say? It's got to be done. <laughs> my car just goes here. I'm not even the boss of my car when it gets close. It's a little vintagey. Berlin. Okay, now there's two of them. Darn it. That makes a difference. $3.99 though. Okay. I'll review these photos and make a decision for in the morning. Three of them from Berlin. Those are vintage. Is this a Sadler? Yes, Sadler. $4.99. England. Ah, my. Okay, let me get a screenshot of that too to show Karen. Okay, I might have to pick that up too, see if she has that one already. 
I'm out in the patio so I could talk to you guys. Okay, they're closing in 10 minutes. They want us to check out. I did not add anything but some lashes. And this, they're still bringing out carts, but I, last one, I'm sure. But look at that for the cat sale, Talavera cat, $2.99. Now you guys got gypped. I put you guys in my pocket. But seriously, you'll have to forgive me. This was a quick pop-in, last call before they close moment. So I did the best I could, and I hope you guys had a little bit of fun anyways. And I will talk to you later or see you on the next video. Bye-bye.